What's up, everybody? This is Jose with Oakland Latinos United, a.k.a. Oakland Latinos Unidos, out here in the V-Town, Vallejo, California, right on the corner of Redwood and Broadway. If you can see behind me, that's uh, Chicken Express over there. We're in front of the Walgreens. And what am I doing here today? Well, I had some things I had to do in Vallejo today, and I decided to pass by here. So this is the site where... Sean Monterosa, 22 years of age, was murdered by Vallejo police. And who is Sean Monterosa and what's the story about? Well, the story is back in June 2nd uh, of this year when, the, uh, when all the, 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 the riots and protests and looting was going on for uh, George Floyd, uh, apparently an incident happened here at this Walgreens. I believe it was getting looted or someone was trying to break into it. And the police showed up here, and a 22-year-old man named Sean Monterosa, who I believe was from San Francisco, a young Chicano, a young Raza, a young Latino, was murdered by the VPD right here. He was actually the second person or second Latino to be killed that same week or that same weekend by police in the Bay Area. Also, another... Um, Latino was murdered in uh, in East Oakland in the Deep East, and his name was uh, oh man, I can't think of his name right now. It'll come back to me, but uh, yeah, Sean Monterosa, as you see right there, says "Rest in Power Tucan," was uh, murdered right here. And a video was released recently where actually I believe it's right back there. They show Vallejo police coming in, I think, in a pickup, and they shoot basically the front windshield in front of them with a fucking high-powered automatic weapon and um yeah the young man was murdered uh according to what they're saying is he he, he had a hammer and he pulled it out and aimed it at them i'm you know it's, it, there's a video that came out of the shooting but it's hard to tell what happened because they don't really show what position he was in when he got shot all you can see is a gun shooting through the windshield like i said shooting through the front and um yeah he was murdered and um oh i remember the name of the guy in oakland his name was eric salgado so he was murdered too by oakland police and supposedly he was under investigation because of looting supposedly i'll look more into that story and make a video about that one as well but um yeah man the story here was it um, Sean Monterosa was murdered by the Vallejo police June 2nd. And, um, you know, there was a video that came out, but there's not much on the video. You know what I mean? You could see, like, the police shooting through the windshield. But you can't really see what Sean Monterosa was doing. Now, there's some people that say he was on his knees with his hands up. And, uh, you know, the video I was hoping would show what really happened, but unfortunately it's very grainy. And I'm not sure if there was video in Walgreens that showed what happened. But if there was, I hope it comes out, man. I hope the police don't try to destroy the evidence. According to what I heard, I read that the window of the police car or the police pickup that was shot up was destroyed. You know what I mean? So, yeah, I guess they, the police destroyed evidence according to what I was reading. So, yeah, man, I mean... It's a crazy, crazy situation. I know that was a crazy night. I know some stores were being looted. I mean, I don't know if Sean Monterosa was out here looting or not. But even if he was, does that excuse him getting murdered by police? You know what I mean? Um, was he acting in a threatening manner? Was he on his knees? You know what I mean? With his hands up? I'm, you know, until a video comes out, only, you know, witnesses, if there were witnesses or, or, or you know, the police is probably going to say their part. And they're already saying that he had his hands up. And, they, they, I mean, they, he, he, he was reaching for a hammer or something like that. And they thought it was a gun. You know, a typical story. But, yeah, it looks like someone, it looks like it originally said a black and brown lives matter. And it looks like someone crossed it out and put all lives. God is the answer. And there's something out there that says, our soldiers hold signs, not guns. So, yeah, so, basically, that's what happened here. This is where they call him Tucan. His name is Sean Monterosa, 22 years old, was murdered by Vallejo police. And it's just another tragic story. 
And it just goes to show you that our people are out here getting killed too. You know, Raza, we get killed and brutalized by police just as much. So just remember that. So that's all I really have to say. This Jose with Oakland Latinos United late.